Hello, colors, and welcome back to Viva Barca. Welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on the latest as usual. We start with Memphis Depay after it has been reported that Newcastle have been offered a chance to sign the Barca star. The club is hoping for 15 million euros for Memphis. We are going to be discussing on that report as we progress. Then, secondly, talking on this other transfer report, claiming that Barcelona have ruled out a move for Premier League midfielder Ruben Neves. Of course, Ruben Neves, as we quite remember, has been one of the candidates to replace Busquets when Busquets depart Barca. So Barcelona have ruled out that move. We are also going to be looking at that. So guys, before we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe. Turn on the post notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Give the video a like and please watch it right up to the very end. Memphis Apai has once again become a hot topic in the transfer market, with many expecting him to depart Barcelona after the turn of the year. The former Man United forward had a difficult start of the season at Barcelona, but after returning from an injury, the attacker has gone on to play a very crucial role for Holland during the World Cup and is now under the radar of many clubs across Europe. According to Dario Sport, Newcastle United are one of the clubs in contention to sign Memphis to pie. The Premier League giants have been monitored, monitoring that players, the, the player situation at Barcelona for quite some time now and could make a move in the upcoming January transfer window. Newcastle United wanted to sign Memphis Depay even in the summer transfer window, but the move did not materialize as the interest from the three parties did not coverage. But things have changed ever since. Barcelona are increasingly determined to offload Memphis in January, while the player itself is aware of the fact that he may not have any future in Javi setup, especially amid competition from players such as Usman Dembele, Robert Lewandowski, Rafinha, uh, Ferran Torres, among many others. Barcelona realized this could be their last opportunity to earn some revenue from the sale of Memphis Depay, whose contract at Camp Nou expires at the end of the season. The Catalans are looking for a figure of somewhere around 15 to 20 million euros for the forward. Newcastle United for their part are expected to begin negotiations with the Pies agents in an attempt to lure the Dutchman to St. James's Park. However, the situation could be complicated by the fact that the Pie has not shown any desire to leave Barca in January. He is aware that he may receive a more lucrative contract if he receive the club if he leaves the club in the summer, meaning the only way the attacker could consider a move away from Camp Nou is if Barcelona hand him a letter of freedom. Memphis Depay continues to be a hot topic of discussion when it comes to transfers for Barcelona. Of course, Memphis Depay has not been a happy man at Barca, um, knowing fully well that game time has drastically reduced um, since Robert Lewandowski came to Barca and of course Ferran Torres having more minutes as well. Um, things have been so difficult. Memphis Depay, who in his in his country or in his national team is being regarded as one of the main players there, but when it comes to Barca, he has been just a, a a squad player, something that clearly the player has not been happy about. Barcelona even wanted to offload him ever since the summer, you know, earlier this year, but it did not materialize as Juventus had to go for another player in Akadusic Milik. You know, so Memphis Depay was just there. Definitely, there were a lot of people arguing that why on earth would Barca want to sell Memphis, whereas you let Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang depart the club and you have Robert Lewandowski there alone without any backup, a 34-year-old striker for that matter. And uh, people thought that maybe the fact that Memphis Depay did not depart is a blessing. But we have not seen nothing. I mean, absolutely nothing. Even when Memphis Depay is available prior to his injury before the World Cup. Um, Javi, in fact, 24-7 is um, um, Robert Lewandowski playing. Uh, Memphis Depay have been frustrated seriously about that. A lot of rumors now have been coming up saying that the player have been linked to many top clubs in Europe. Newcastle United have now entered the fray. And according to reports, FC Barcelona are expecting at least, at least 15 million euros. They want a range even between 15 to 20 million if Memphis Depay wants to depart, you know. But for Memphis Depay's own part, they are reporting that the player does not want to leave based on money. He wants to leave as a free agent. That is, he wants to leave the same way he came to Barca. He came to Barca, we quite remember, as a free agent. 
from Olympique Lyon in France and he wants to depart. He wants Barca to, you know, to hand him a letter of freedom because normally with the letter of freedom, you are now officially a free agent, even if you were valued, even you had your contract still there. Once a club gives you a letter of freedom, then you are free to choose whatever club you want to go to without paying a single penny. So definitely that's how it is. Uh, if Newcastle will succeed, nobody knows as it stands. But Barcelona won 15 million euros. But it's going to be so difficult because, as I said earlier, Memphis Depay wants to leave Barca as a free agent. He doesn't want to leave, you know, on based on the fact that he still has a contract. So I think there will be some conflict there between the club and Memphis Depay's agents. Then moving on to the next story of discussion, Barcelona's search for a new number number six has been well documented. The club are desperately looking for a defensive midfielder that can replace Sergio Busquets in the long run. The veteran midfielder has been an excellent servant for the club over the past decade or so. But his contract at Camp Nou expires at the end of the season, although Xavi is keen on keeping hold of him at least for another season. There are suggestions that he may move to the United States. In light of Busquets' uncertain future, Barcelona are ready to splash the cash on a new defensive midfielder in the summer of 2023. One of the targets Barca had in mind was Ruben Neves. The Wolverhampton Wanderer star has been on the radars for the Catalan Giants for a very long time now, thanks to his consistent performances in the Premier League. Neves' aggressive and work ethic in the middle of the park and the fact that his contract expires in 2024 made him an appealing target for Barcelona. However, according to Javi Miguel of AS, FC Barcelona are ready to move on from the Portuguese international and target other stars such as Martin Zubimendi. This is because Xavi considers Neves unsuitable for Barca. The club have already had a hard time in investing in Frank Kisi, who is here to be used to life at Camp Nou, with reports linking him with an exit in January. Xavi similarly does not see Neves as a player with the right profile to operate in the pivot position in Barcelona's 4-3-3 system. Some reports even claim that the Barcelona coach may find a new defensive midfielder even if Barcelona signed the Portuguese international in the summer. Therefore, the club are ready to move on, with Zubimendi emerging as the likeliest option now. The Spaniard knows the league very well and should not find it even difficult to settle into Xavi's tactical setup. As for Ruben Neves, he was said to be the preferred option for President Juan Laporta, however, it seems like Barca have ruled out the move for the Portuguese. So, Colas, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please make sure to do so so you always stay up to date with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye bye.